Hi, this is Carol with a minute of your day, and today we're going to talk about Pinocchio. You know, Pinocchio knows, that's what he should have been called, because his nose would grow when he tell a lie. Well, you know, sometimes when you're working with your loved one who has dementia, you might have to tell a little lie. Is it a lie? Liar, liar, pants on fire? Well, I don't think so. I call it therapeutic fibbing. When you have to take a story, turn it around, and make it beneficial for that person that you're telling the story to. I have a wonderful new client whose wife moved into a memory care, and she's a little bit upset with him right now, and she's not understanding what's going on. Are we going to tell her, honey, you got to live here forever, so just shut up and be happy about it? <laughs> or you can say that. It's really not going to go well. Instead, I told him, you go in and say, well, honey, where do you want to go? She'll say, I want to go home. Okay, that's a great idea. What are we going to do when we get there? Are you going to cook? Yes, I'm going to cook. Well, what are you going to cook? Or she might say, no, you're going to take me out to eat. Okay, where do we want to go? And then he should say, let's go get a snack first. Or let's go to hear this music first. Or let me get a couple things done. We're going to make this happen. Always upbeat, always positive. It's not Pinocchio nose. Nose is not going to grow. Blessings and smiles.